Uh, good afternoon to the Honorable Ministers, Excellencies, uh, FAO officials, and representatives of regional and international organizations that are present. I make this presentation on behalf of the Honorable Peter David, who is on his way at this time to the meeting, and on behalf of the government and people of Grenada. First, let me express our appreciation to the government and people of Ecuador for the excellent organization of this conference in these trying times, and to the FAO for the support they have given to Grenada and the region over the last couple of years. We want to express our appreciation for all of the sacrifice that you have made to ensure that we can meet at this time. Chair, I want to thank you for the opportunity to comment on the session and to share with you Grenada's actions and recommendations to help us address the issues of better production. In fact, as many of the other presenters have said, the COVID-19 pandemic has, has taught us many lessons. And one of those is that all of us need to look at the issue of better production by pursuing targeted strategies that create a more sustainable and resilient food system. So at the national level, uh, Grenada has been focusing on, on the issue of drafting, adopting, and implementing national legislation that look at the issue of land and its management with an emphasis on soil management, as I've heard other presenters advocate, because this is extremely important for sustainable national development, but also to build resilience in the agricultural sector, which is urgently needed. Providing support to the farming community to expand the acreages that are under production and that is focusing on new technologies such as protective structures, irrigation, uh, solar-powered uh, pumps, etc. But also looking at research into new crop varieties uh, and, 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 and focusing also on crop production data, which has been a challenge for our farmers to be able to access resources from the commercial entities. We therefore need to look at developing protocols to respond to climate impacts, such as climate variability, drought, storms, hurricanes, and this needs urgent attention. Improving the, the, the access to, to, to lands, as my colleague from Dominica has, has said, uh, to put unproductive lands back into production. And in fact, government has allocated $47 million towards uh, rehabilitating farm roads across the island so that we could increase those acreages under production. Providing support for the, the um, propagating stations to increase the production of, of planting material that is then made available to farmers is also a priority. And uh, we have been working very closely with the, with the FAO in implementing a national land bank project, which is also targeted at bringing idle government and private lands into production with a focus on youth in agriculture, because we are seeing an aging population and we need to get young people back into agricultural production. Uh, the issue of labor that is available for agriculture is a vexing problem and is something that needs to be looked at closely across the region. And um, government has been providing some labor subsidy to the agricultural sector, but we are struggling with that because um, we need to be able to be more efficient in how we implement this program. Also providing opportunities for increased private sector investment to include the development of proposals for, for, for re research facilities to look at um, tissue culture, new crop varieties, exotic crops um, is also of priority for us and we want to ensure that these are, are looked at. Disaster risk reduction is of optimum importance. And I have heard our colleagues mention the establishment of a fund to address this is of top priority. We cannot sustain the frequency and severity of the disasters we are facing in the Caribbean in particular. Every year from June to November, we have to be preparing for hurricanes or storms or flash flooding, et cetera. And planning to, 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 to ensure that we, we, can, we can capitalize on the opportunities to fund, this must be given high priority. And included in this must be crop insurance 
for not only tree crops, but also vegetables so that farmers can have some support to recover quickly is of high priority. Finally, we support better coordination at the level of OECS, CARICOM, and the LAC to ensure that we improve trade as this is a vital aspect of our regional food and economic security. I thank you. Thank you very much, Grenada.